Hey you guys, what's up? I am the Spawn. Today, welcome back to our episode of Pokemon Black 2. In the last episode, we challenged Elite Four Grimsley and we defeated him with really no problems at all. Um, anyways, I'm gonna use a high proportion on Hoodlum, and that shall be it for preparation for the next battle. Uh, once again, Hoodlum um, is gonna shine, or at least I hope so. Anyways, look at this beautiful thing. And we have a flower. Opening out of nothing. And a girl pops outside. It's magic. It's me who appears when the flower opens up. You, standing over there. You look like a Pokemon trainer with strength and kindness. What I look for in my opponent is superb strength. I'm counting on you. Alright, she's counting on us. We have Elite 4 Caitlyn, who is practically falling asleep, but anyways. Uh, we are challenged by Elite 4 Caitlyn, who is sending out Mushara. Yes, this is a Psychic type user, uh, and basically one of the most hard hardest ones in my opinion. Um, but anyways, if you have a Dark type or Bug type or Ghost type, you should be fine in this battle. Anyways. So yeah, uh, as you all know, we have Hoodlum. Hoodlum has been putting in a lot of work in this Elite Four, actually. And right after this, he will grow to level 60, our strongest member on the team. We have Moxie, alright, of course, as always. We're on level 60. We have Runiclus. Alright, so let's go for a crunch. And this thing does not survive. So once again we'll get a Moxie boost. Serpent is level 59. And we have a Sigilith. Let's go for the crunch. He's gonna go for an air slash, alright. And we flinched. And no god damn it, I fear we might die here. Yes we did. God damn it. Well, uh, let's go for Unagi. Anyways, I like it. Uh, we actually got killed. Um, <laughs> actually, which is really nice since, you know, I would like a challenge from Elite 4, but like I said, the victory route is more challenging than the Elite 4 itself, in my opinion at least. Um, but yeah, Thunderbolt will kill it off. And last but not least, we have got the Tell. Let's just stay in. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna go for a crunch or a stab Thunderbolt, but I think let's go for the crunch. And she's gonna set up. Goddamn. This could be really difficult, actually. Luckily, we're using physical attacks, so at least that doesn't count. And dang it, now it takes another extra turn to beat this thing. Psychic. Mm, it's gonna hurt, I think so. Yeah, hurt a lot actually. Anyways, let's go for Ness. Let's go for a Surf. Thunderbolt. Oh god, damn it! I totally forgot this thing could learn Thunderbolt. Dang. Surf do nice amount of damage. Dang it, anyways, we're gonna die after this, so let's go for a nice shard. Just so we can get a little bit of damage off before we vaporize. And Psychic should kill us off. Yes. Right, actually having a really difficult time, but I believe Mortar will finish the deal. Let's go for a nice and powerful flamethrower. Alright. There she goes down. You and your Pokémon are both excellent and elegant. To have been able to battle against such a splendid team, my Pokémon and I learned a lot. I offer you my thanks. And we got the same amount of money. 
You haven't faced all of the members of the Four yet, have you? Don't concern about me. Go on ahead. All right, nice and quick, like, um, yeah. Anyways, guys, this shall be it for this episode. Next episode, we'll be doing the last Elite Four member. Anyways, I will see you guys all in the next episode, and stay tuned for more Pokemon Black 2.